First, we begin in Grover Beach, where KSPY's Olivia Gonzalez Britt has more on a shelter that aims to provide safety and privacy for single adults experiencing homelessness. As all developments do, it all started as a pile of dirt. But six months later, this is what the Bolaico and Barca non congregate shelter looks like now. I'm Olivia Gonzalez Britt covering your community in Grover Beach, where now 30 cabins will provide privacy and safety for those experiencing homelessness. A new shelter site for people experiencing homelessness is opening soon in Grover Beach. Bolaico and Barca will offer shelter space and vital services for those in need. Located off Ford's Street. This site is the county's second non-congregate shelter following the success of the Cabins for Change program, which opened in December 2022 on 16th Street and Long Branch Avenue. Frida Morton is one of Cabin for Change's success stories. She experienced homelessness for a year and a half in Arizona before returning to her hometown of Arroyo Grande. I always wanted to come home. So in order for me to do that, I had to lose everything there, even though being on the streets ain't the greatest thing in the world. But it's a eye opener and a lesson of what you truly want. She now has her own place and is celebrating one year at her job. They saved my life. And every day they show me I'm going to be achieving more, even more than I know. But with their blessing, I know I'm going to go big. The new site, which features showers, bathrooms, laundry rooms, and single cabins, will take on the same approach as cabins for change. But what we do is we work with them with a series of wraparound services to help them stabilize and then really assess what their needs are in order to help them find housing. In two weeks, single adults will start moving in and can stay for at least 90 days while receiving support. There's already a wait list of 310 people showing the high demand for such programs. The, the challenges are, are great. Uh, we're proud to say that we have moved 50 people through our cabins for change program um, through into ha permanent housing. With a success rate of 70% in moving people into permanent housing from that program, according to Jana Nichols, Five Cities Homeless Coalition Executive Director, there's hope that this new shelter will also bring positive change to the community. And if you believe that it's possible for you, they'll see it too and they'll help you drive. Just don't give up. The land purchase for the Five Cities Homeless Coalition by the city of Grover Beach was funded by the American Rescue Act and will be leased for the next 55 years. In Grover Beach, Olivia Gonzalez-Britt, KSPY News.